Hi guys, it's Mina. Okay, I am ready. I think. Good luck, kids. <laughs> no, I like that. Leave it in there. Okay, so we're gonna do the straight pour. I think I've got it. I'm gonna trust my gut and just listen to myself and go for it. So we have. Here we go. We have Van Dyke Brown from Golden's. This is a combination of the full body paint and the uh, high flow, no, not the high flow, but the fluid acrylics. So not the, <laughs> not the thick stuff. <laughs> That's a combination of the thick stuff and the thin stuff. Um, my pouring medium was Liquitex pouring medium and water until it was a little thicker than I wanted. And then I added some Floetrol to thin it out so that it would spread out easy because we are doing a straight pour today. Don't let me do anything other than a straight pour. Okay. <laughs> and this is my copper from uh, Deco Art uh, Americana Decor Series. I love this color. It's beautiful. And my very favorite 24 karat gold from the Deco Art Americana. So, and I have also more of the Van Dyke Brown thinned out to put on the canvas. This is a cradle board. This is an 18 by 36. And I have painted the corners and edges already so that they, I don't have to worry about covering them. And I have to remind myself of that because the last one I painted it and I didn't have to worry about it and then I worried about it anyway and I screwed it up. So we're going to do a dirty pour and I'm doing it on camera. So, okay, this is a Catamount Flameware. Uh, I love these things. This one is four cups. So I'm kind of guessing at this point. So for the 20 by 20, I was doing 16 ounces which is there and this is almost double that would be 32 ounces let's shoot for like 24 ounces and see how we end up we can always do another layer so 24 ounces is three cups it's right there so dirty pour three colors i'm gonna go brown copper gold and then I might repeat. <laughs> okay, my consistency is very thin, not leaving a mound. Um, well, maybe a tiny one. But I want it thin because we're gonna do a straight pour. Okay, now I'm just babbling because I'm stalling. Okay, here we go. One, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna put about a cup since I have three colors. So there's one cup, and that's almost all the paint, so that's good. I'm going to do another cup of copper right into the middle. So we get two cups. The wind is gearing up. She's blowing. Hello, darling. Okay. And the gold to get to three cups. Let's see what happens. Okay. Wow. That's pretty. All right. I'm going to pour that in just a second. So, base coat. Yes, Van Dyke Brown. I'm probably going to spread some out with my fingers too. It's all good. I still have more paint over there too. Okay, this is, I'm expecting it to set up quick, so I'm working fast. Okay, covers are dealt with, but we'll put a little bit more in there. Be in the mud. Go. <clears throat> All right, you guys ready? I'm ready. I'm excited. I've been working towards this one for a while now. Okay, straight pour into the center. Three colors, Van Dyke Brown, Copper, and 24 karat Gold. Here we go. Give that a minute to do its thing. Don't come creeping over here. 
stay over there in the middle. <coughs> give this a quick torch. Sparkle, but it's pretty intense. Okay, of course, this is a rectangle now. It's a square. <laughs> it's moving and it will move. I just want to give it a second to catch up and do its thing. there. Moving, doing good things. I like the cells, even like that. So we're going to go back to the middle. Oof, no wind. It's my canvas. Stop it. Can't take it. She's trying my like Crap out of myself. <laughs> okay. 
this side. Hopeful. I haven't really quite looked at it yet because I'm kind of scared. <laughs> I've literally been trying to get this one to work for a long time now. I think. Wow, that's pretty cool. Wow. Should we torch it? Let's torch it. enjoyed that. Um, I hope this works. I've been sort of trying to get this dark background floating cells thing straight for to work for a long time now and I keep doing something at the last second to mess it up. <laughs> so <laughs> this was dirty cup straight pour. Not too much tilting we're good so it is starting to set up and I don't want it to crack I don't think it will but I don't want it to so I'm gonna go make some space for it in the studio and then uh, I will take some pictures and close up for you guys and I thank you for watching and hanging out with me and uh, seeing what I'm up to Get out of my oh. I'm gonna take this inside before 50 flies land on it <laughs> thanks for watching guys I'll see you for the next one have a great day Oh my goodness. So, I think maybe it may have worked. This may be the one. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not, but it's pretty darn cool. So, I literally just finished. I didn't tilt it too much. So, sorry about the glare. It's really sunny today course anyways there's the light gold cells floating on the dark background which I love nice copper sort of soft design
copper cells, copper and gold cells floating on the pain or the Van Dyke Brown. Love, 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 love. So it's kind of interesting along the edges. So that one is, it's starting to really set up and dry. I got to get it out of the sun. But there's some really cool stuff in there. Anyway, hope you guys like that one. Ooh, I do. I like how it's kind of got a swirl going too. Awesome. Anyways, have fun. I'll see you later. Bye.